kind of awkwardly sit here for a minute. This is my third try. Okay, maybe it's working this time. This is my third try doing this live. The first two times it said it was unable to play the video. So I tried turning off everything that I had on my other monitors to see if that would work. Maybe it was a bandwidth thing. Anyway, hi. <laughs> I'm Amanda. Most of you know me. Hopefully all of you know me by now. Um, I saw Scentsy through my Tangled Sense. Um, I got two packages in the mail yesterday and today, so I thought I would open them for you all and show you what I got, which they're now open, but I'm still going to show you everything. Hopefully this live will keep going. Um, if you're watching, thank you for watching. Um, if you're watching live, well, this is live, sorry. Um, tell me where you're watching from. And if you watch this later, maybe hashtag replay. So I know what time everybody's watching. Who's all watching? I'm very awkward right now. Because, um, yeah, every thought I had in my head about how this was going to go, it just, it's gone now since the first two t tries were just garbage. All right. So first, I think I will just show you my Cincy Club, since that's what's nearest at hand. Um, every month... I get a package with these awesome things. They're called cotton cleanups. I'm going to start putting these in orders, I think, for other people because I'm actually getting quite a stock of these. But you can clean several of your warmers with these. They soak up so much wax. It's insane. It's so much better than using cotton balls. Um, let's see. Let's pull this up. I got the same thing as last month except for I added some light bulbs because I didn't have any. Which I haven't had to change them yet. But I thought it would be nice to have some on hand. I have some more of my Cozy Cardigan lotion because this is like my favorite scent right now. And I want to make sure I have plenty on hand. I got some waxes. I'm thinking they're all the same from last month. I don't remember changing. And I also got <clears throat> a travel tin because I think these are really nifty. You can put it in your car or your closet, whatever you want to put it in. The more you open it, the more scent comes out. I don't know how long those last. I haven't tried it yet, but I'm excited to put that in my car. I got the weathered leather scent. And then for bars, I got the Johnny Appleseed. I have no idea if anybody can actually see. I got the Mandalorian because I just, I don't know. I really like this scent. It's not something I normally would use, but I really like it. French lavender, I like to keep this on hand. Some local people that like that. Cloudberry Dreams, which is the one of the um, scents I've been sending out in my samples this month because it is just, it smells even better warming, which I didn't think was possible, but it's, it's so just light and it's sweet. And it just brightens up the room very well. Cozy Cardigan, as I said, that's my favorite scent. I have to smell all these. It just, I'm not sure. It just makes me feel so relaxed. And it's just such a comforting smell for me. I'm not sure why. It's a very feminine scent. And I know I've described it before, but it kind of makes me think of like if you're just wearing your just most comfortable sweater and it has that hint of like your favorite cologne or perfume on it and you're just curled up in a big soft chair and it's just yes it's one of my favorites and then farmer's market which is another one that I didn't think I was going to like as much as I do and it's just I'm not good at describing things kind of a, a 
a vegetable smell, but not. It's pretty much like if you're walking through the farmer's market and there's like pumpkins and squash and not tomatoes. It doesn't have that smell. It's just a nice, pleasant smell. Pardon me. All right. I'm sorry. I'm so awkward at this. I don't see any comments yet, but I do see someone who's watching. Hopefully I'm not too boring. All right. This one's exciting. This is my whiff box. I get this every month with my Scentsy Club. And since I buy a certain amount, I actually get this for half price. And this always comes with something different. You never know what you're going to get. I'm trying to actually look at the camera, but it's hard because I keep looking at myself. It comes with this little paper every time. It's different every time. This one has recipe cards you can cut out. And they're actually really cute. This is Happy Fall. It's one of the best times of year and we're diving in deep. Your September whiff box includes an amazing assortment of seasonal goodies and we even included a brochure for our 2020 harvest collection so you can find even more ways to embrace the season. Which already had some, but the harvest collection. I'm sure you've all seen it by now. Okay, this month came with two scent circles. Caramel Apple Craze, which I haven't used before. I wish I could actually see good. And Autumn Road Trip, which I know I've been sending out the Scratch and Sniff stickers, stickers for those. Came with Wax Bar Pumpkin Chai, which pretty it smells exactly what it's like what it's called, pumpkin chai. Like if you had a chai tea with some pumpkin spice added to it, it would smell like that. Came with a sampler of walnut raisin muffin, which is October's scent of the month. Come with a couple samples of the laundry line, the shimmer, laundry liquid, and scent soft. Came with the Halloween Town wax. Which smells kind of spicy to me. Spicy, fruity. I wonder if it says the description anywhere. Halloween Town. Everybody screams for a sinister portion of cranberry, apple, and spiced cedar wood concocted in the dead of night. Which I really like this scent. I would recommend it if you like a kind of spicy, fruity smell. It doesn't seem like it'd be overpowering. And then it came with a wax bar of Ghostly Greeting, which if you've watched any of my lives or talked to me, you know this is like my obsession right now. I use the room spray every day in here. And last but definitely not least, it came with the Butter Pecan Sugar Scrub which I have not tried these yet, the sugar scrubs. I've got to learn how to show these things off better. I'm excited about this one. I haven't used the sugar scrub. And it is a, it's hefty. It's a good size. So as you can tell, these whip boxes give you quite an assortment of goodies for a decent price. All right, last but not least, I got my warmer of the month thing. This is going to be October's warmer of the month. I'll start out with the wax because it is on top. I got this huge brick of walnut raisin muffin, which surprisingly, because I've already smelled it in one of my first attempts at this live. It is really good. This is going to be one of my favorites, I think, this fall. It is a spicy... It says raisin muffin. I'm just smelling like a pie. Like a pie spice. Came with the waxes, the tester, the brick, a room spray. And the, warm, the warmer of the month. And then... 
also in here is the Got another one of the bars. So I, it came with a brick and three wax bars. And the pamphlets. The scratch and sniff stickers. I have not unboxed this yet. This is my first time seeing this. And I was really excited about this one. It looked so pretty in the picture. I'm running out of space on my desk. There's the little melting tray. Is that what it's called? I'm not sure what it's called. It's what I call it. There's going to be the top of it. see this? It's got fairy lights in it. I don't have anywhere to plug it in in here unless you want to see me crawling under my desk. So I will post pictures later of this lit up. See the fairy lights? But I am excited about this one. This is definitely my type of warmer. And this doesn't have a light bulb. This is one of the element warmers, I think they're called. So it just has like a heating element in there to warm up the wax. The wax will go in top and then this pops it on top. And it's like an old fashioned lantern looking warmer. Is that not the prettiest thing? I could see this going in a lot of different homes, a lot of different decor that would match. Um, rustic for sure. Any kind of maybe. People who like more old fashioned, old timey type of things, but I think it would also look really good with modern decor too. Put that up, put some nice flowers, maybe seasonal around it. And those fairy lights are gonna be so pretty lit up. Um that's pretty much all I have for today. I'm just mostly putting off my homework and I thought maybe y'all would like to see the warmer of the month and the whiff box because I know I love the whiff box because I you never know what you're gonna get. It's a surprise every month. The warmer of the month, of course, you know what you're gonna get. They tell you ahead of time. Or yeah, you probably wouldn't want to buy it. But the whiff box is so much fun because you open it up and it's like it's like it's your birthday every time you get one. Just a surprise every time. And then, of course, my Cincy Club. The Cincy Club, if you don't know about that, um, it's a monthly. I think you can do it every month, every other month, or every three months. I'm, I really need to bone up on my information. But um, you just put what you want in it. Get it every month. That way, like the bars, if they stop making them, you continue to get the sense that you want. They will continue making it as long as it's in your club. So I think that is great. I have some that think, I can't remember what they've stopped making. There was a couple I think that I put in there that I'm keeping just because they don't make them anymore. Sorry, I'm very thirsty today. So if you have any questions, write them in the comments, um, DM me. If you have my number, text me. I'll answer. As you know, if I don't know the answer, I'll find the answer for you. And once again, my name's Amanda, My Tangled Sense. You can find my site, mytangledsense.cincy.us, if you want to order anything. Or if you're local, you know, you can, I can order for you. You can pick up. I can drop off at your porch. All right, well, thank you for watching. Um, like I said, just let me know when you watched. If you watched live, if it was a replay, hashtag replay. And any questions, let me know. Thank you so much. Bye.